Hello children, in this video we will get to know how we can merge the worksheets. Sometimes multiple reviewers return edited versions of a worksheet at the same time. In this case it may be quicker to review all of these changes at once rather than one review at a time. For this purpose Calc provides the feature of merging worksheets. To merge worksheets, all of the edited worksheets need to have recorded changes in them. Right? So, we are going to implement it practically now. Okay. This is my original worksheet. Fine. And what is the requirement? of merging worksheet that you should record the changes in the worksheet right so here you have to click on the edit menu and then click on the changes and then click on the record fine so what now whatever change i'll do it will be recorded let us suppose i am adding one more uh, row here like I'm giving now you can see the new row is having red boundary, right? So and if you will uh, take your cursor here, uh, one comment is coming cell E9 change from empty to 70, right? Now, and when you, uh, so it is showing you that you have entered a new row. Fine, you have entered a new row inside your worksheet. Okay, so this is my original worksheet. Now, I'll open the copy of the worksheet here okay and i am making again i'll record the changes in this also record okay so neha's marks are 67 i can make them 80 see and from here 80 to i am making them 60 right so i have edited you can see and comment is also coming cell B7 change from empty to 80, right? And this also. Okay, so we have two sheets, right? And now we have to merge these two sheets. Come to the original worksheet here. Fine. So how you will merge the sheets, click on the edit menu and then click on the changes option and in changes option you will get merge document option, right? So it will ask you the name of the worksheet that you want to merge. So we will merge edited worksheet right open fine okay so accept or reject changes dialog box has come okay after the worksheets are merged the accept or reject changes dialog opens right okay showing changes by more than one reviewer if you want to merge more worksheet close the dialog and repeat step two and three okay now you can see uh, it is showing you all the changes uh, change contains sheet one uh, uh, cell a9 then b9 okay so it is showing you all the if you want to accept all the changes you will click on accept all and if you want to reject all changes you will click you will click on reject all right it is up to you okay so 
here I am accepting the changes. So I am clicking on this accept all. Fine. Okay, so I have accepted the all changes and I have merged both the sheet in one worksheet, right? Okay, now we can also compare the documents, right? When sharing worksheet, reviewers may forget to record the changes they make. Sometimes what happens, the people forget to record the changes, right? So in this condition, uh, what you will have to do in order to compare the worksheet, you need to have the original worksheet and the one that is edited without record, right? So here I'm going to compare the worksheet. So open the edited worksheet. So this is my edited worksheet that you want to compare with the original worksheet. This is my edited worksheet. Now you can see, okay. Uh, this is my edited worksheet and I want to compare it with the original worksheet. So what I'll do, I'll click on the select, sorry, I click on the edit menu and then compare document option. Now it is telling you this action will exit the change recording mode. Any information about change will be lost. Yes. Okay. So what it was telling me that you can compare the documents when they don't have record option. So I have clicked on the yes. Okay. So that it will stop recording. Okay. Now, after this, an open worksheet dialog box appears. So here we will select the original worksheet. This is my original worksheet. Open right okay okay now calc finds and marks the changes as follows now you can say you can see here all the changes row deleted content changed all the these are recorded here right so you can see here so whatever the changes you have made it is available here right so here we are comparing the two sheets so how it shows all the data that occurs in the edited worksheet but not in the original is identified as inserted fine is identified as inserted okay all the data that is in your original worksheet but not in the edited worksheet is identified as deleted fine Okay, what it is telling all the data that is in your original worksheet but not in the edited worksheet is identified as deleted. Now you can see row deleted is here because uh, in uh, original worksheet we have extra row here. Okay, we have inserted but in uh, edited worksheet we don't have that extra row. That's why row deleted is coming here. All the data that is changed is marked as change. So, whatever the changes are here, it is marked as change. So, in this way, we have compared both the sheets, right? So, this is up to us whether we want to accept all or reject all. Okay. So, I have accepted the changes, right? Okay. So, here we have done how we can merge the worksheet and how we can compare the worksheet.